Drought can take its toll on crops in two ways, with a lack of precipitation and increased transpiration, which steals away any moisture stored in the plants. When I was a kid, my mom told me that when you run into some difficulties, you know, don't be afraid, just get over it and you will become stronger. Agricultural scientist Ping Fu has taken the age-old aphorism, what doesn't kill you makes you stronger, and applied it to his crop research. He found that crops that survive drought conditions in the early growing season end up stronger if there's also a drought in the late season. So this drought actually gave the crops an opportunity you know, to learn, okay, there's a drought, there's a stress on us. You know, we need to adapt to ourselves. He calls it drought memory. His study showed that if there's a late summer drought, corn and soybean crops that also experienced the difficulty of drought in the spring were able to mitigate losses up to 7% compared to crops that had not yet experienced drought. He says it's not actual memories like humans have, but memory on a molecular and cellular level. Like a, how our body actually defends from the virus after we get the vaccination. In his analogy, the late summer drought is the virus and the early season drought is the vaccination. He says information gets stored in the plant cells that protect it from future drought. And now he believes that he can find the cells that stored the drought memory and give that information to breeders so they can develop a more drought resistant crop. Yeah, as a researcher, I'm optimistic about those things. Meteorologist Corey Reppenhagen, Nine News.